have made it back to Argentina. Yesterday I took a bus from Puerto Natales to El Calafate and then from El Calafate to here. It was a pretty good journey but it did take quite a long time. I left at 7 and I got in at about 6.30 so it was almost 12 hours. I did not expect that. It was not planned like that. I will say there is an hour time difference between Puerto Natales right now and Argentina. Uh, so maybe that had to do with anything. I don't know if you can tell, but I'm I'm pretty sick. <laughs> not gonna lie, I've not felt the best. But that's not gonna stop me from doing anything today. I think that's the water pipes that make so much noise. I'll continue this later. Yesterday I did not film anything and I've come to a bit of a realization which is that while posting and making videos every single day has been a lot of fun and I love looking back on everything that I've done I think that maybe not everything needs to be filmed like yes I want to keep these memories and yes that's why I'm doing this but yesterday I spent the entire day on the bus and nothing exciting happened except for when we got stopped by I think national guards or something and they came and did a passport check on anyone of, or everyone on the bus and then they had a drug sniffing dog canine dog whatever um come onto the bus and do a test everything was fine but that was a little bit interesting but other than that nothing interesting happened so i think days like that i'm just gonna skip because it takes it takes a lot of effort and a lot of time to make these edit these and upload them and days where i'm actually doing something i do want to remember but days where i've just been sick in bed I, I filmed not every single day when I was sick for a week in Indonesia last year but I filmed too much and I think that those type of days don't need to be filmed. Days like yesterday when I just spent an entire day on the bus don't need to be filmed today. I am do plan on doing something interesting so I'm obviously gonna want to remember it and bring the camera along but I think, I think this is where the daily uploads end. And while I'm saying that, I'm still posting the first few videos of Uruguay. So I guess the daily uploading has ended. I think today is like April, I don't know, April, I think it might have been April 14th, 13th, I'm not sure. But that is when I think the daily uploads have come to die. And it's fine. I will still be making these and uploading these because I like it and I like it to have to, to have something to look back on when I'm starting to forget things from the trip or when I'm older. Another thing is most people who come to El Jalten or El Jalten, however you pronounce it, will go to Fitzroy. Fitzroy is a big mountain here. Now obviously you're not going to climb all the way to the top but there's like a lagoon nearby. I met a girl who said it took her about 12 hours there and back. I've just done Torres del Paine base tower hike which took me i think eight or nine hours i think eight seven i'm not sure it took me a while and aside from the fact that i'm sick i think that is just not for me right now but there are some shorter hikes here nearby what you can do so i am going to do one of those and i'm gonna try the breakfast here is not included but i'm gonna try to find some food and then get changed and I think it's time to do a little hike. So the viewpoint that I'm going to go to is about a kilometer or two away. Uh, one way, quite easy. I think more of a walk than a hike. But nonetheless, I think it'll be nice. So apparently on this hike you're supposed to be able to see Andy and Gondors but I guess that makes sense because the viewpoint is called Mirador Gondor. I hope I see some. And apparently they can get up to 95 centimeters which I think is insanely tall. <laughs> The view 
view from here is already pretty insane. I mean, look at that. That's very, very nice. But that's not quite the end destination. We got a little bit more to go. If I can make it through. Ah, oh, nice and shaded. But I think it's a little bit further for the actual viewpoint. It is time to head down again because honestly I need to lay down for a bit. I am so tired. Ah, oh, being sick is not fun. But the viewpoint is very nice, very well worth it, and very easy to go up to. Like if I can do it when I'm sick, anybody can do it. Like kids can come up here, I think, as long as you are able to do some walking. Older people can do it as well. And the view is very nice. You get a view of the mountains and the town. So I spent pretty much the entire day in bed and I'm not gonna lie, the fact that I'm out of bed right now is a pretty big accomplishment. <laughs> I hope I'm starting to feel better the next few days. For now I'm gonna go cook something and go straight to bed, so I will see you tomorrow.